A compelling portrait is much more than just another pretty face. Drawings of dreamy, sometimes melancholic youths present an easy aesthetic that has a universal appeal, much like sunsets in a landscape painting. Yet for the artist who strives for a deeper meaning in the work, depictions of youth and beauty can become a vapid exercise. Portraits that move and stay with us are those that tell a story and connect us with a shared humanity. The best works are those that present a monumental description of form and an empathetic treatment of character and personality. Mastering Portrait Drawing 3, Advanced Techniques and Considerations pursues this discourse of portraiture using Sanguine Conte. My subject is a lively, life-tested woman captured in a candid glance. It is a momentary pose whose transients speak volumes of an easy, albeit somewhat lubricated, social engagement. But there are technical challenges here. Foremost is a casual gesture that is underpinned by a convex facial angle and the immediacy of an inquisitive gaze through a pair of glasses. Those must be rendered in such a way that they sit naturally on the face without drawing unwarranted attention. And all this must be buttressed by the anatomical structures of a broad smile. The whole of this expression is incumbent on all of the forms working effortlessly as a single unit. Our goal as artists is to seamlessly marry craft and emotion. In this four-hour workshop, I comprehensively discuss and demonstrate the entire step-by-step -step process of drawing an expressive portrait in Sanguine Conte from its initial beginning to completion. This workshop is for the intermediate to advanced artists. Whereas I do begin with the initial striking of the arabesque and structural landmarks, I move through them quite quickly. The agenda here is with more advanced considerations, particularly with establishing the primary plumb line for the convex facial angle and how to finely place and shape the glasses within a subtle perspective while simultaneously rendering the eyes. Many artists have trouble with a full smile, and knowing your facial anatomy pays off big here. Equally important is knowing when to step away from the easel. There is a fine line between a vibrant drawing and one that flops lifelessly from overwork. Mind you, there is no ready formula to tell you that's it. Only experience.